Hello everybody, this is David Harris from Street Self Defense 101. This is my partner here, Terrence. We're going to do a demonstration on wrist locks. The reason why I'm stressing this um, category of today is because most of the time, especially in parks like these, you got a lot of rapists, muggers, pedophiles, and all sorts of weirdos running around Central Park. Because most of the time, you get these big, strong, maybe six foot five guys, either muscularly built or stocky or whatever size they are, they tend to, in great majority of the time, is grab you with a lot of force, right? And our reaction is, it's just to go along with it because we are afraid that we that they might do something else to us. So what you want to do is, when they grab you, you want to get out the lock. So this is how we gonna get out the lock. First, I'm gonna show it to you slow. What you do is you come up, right? Then, as you come towards the elbow, you wanna pat the elbow on top, and then you wanna come down. But in order to do a lock like this, you gotta first add an attack to it. So, as we start over with the scenario, what you do is grab, right? So you kick, you come up, you come over, you bring them down. Then from there, you step in, in the lowest stance possible, sliding in with the elbow. And he should be able to fly in that direction. Now, in real time, it's not gonna be slow. It's gonna be as quick as under a second. So, if he grabs me again, basically, I'm just gonna come here. Even if I add the kick, And as you can see, this stuff works. All you have to do is practice, practice, practice diligently, and you get as good as you can be. So thank you for the um, watch. See you guys around.